Well, welcome to a segment that our parent company's lawyers inform me I cannot call Monday Night Football. That's a joke. But we are here with all our rowdy friends. We've got some D Ian delayed games to get to. So here we go. We'll start at Paul Langford Stadium, the doghouse. Look at all these Swanee students doing their part on a school night hosting Taylor County. We were scoreless in the first. Swanee knocking on the door. Bronson Tillotson calls his own number. QB sneak. Home team up 7-0 just like that for the Bulldogs that are in green and gold. Speaking of the Bulldogs, how about the ones in orange and blue? Taylor going to try to answer here, but Swanee blows it off on the backfield. Ty Moses got there first. Taylor behind the chains, but the visitors from Perry would find their footing on the ground. Moving the sticks as Caden Collier rough and tumbles his way all the way for the first down. He signals, move those chains, Mr. Referee. That sets up the pass, though, for Taylor County. Ethan Tutton going to take the snap, going to go deep into the arms of J.J. Clayton. He pays the price for the hit from Javarian Smith, but the drive stalls. Turnover on downs inside two minutes now. 14 nothing Swanee. They're looking for more Tillotson rolling to his left. Finds Cody Lang. He's going to rumble his way past the first down marker into extra yards. Very plus territory for Swanee. But Coach Hall and company have to settle for three. But you know what? You don't worry about it when you've got the foot of Braxton Green. The kid is automatic. 17 nothing Swanee at the break. 38 nothing your final score from Live Oak. Heading now to Monticello, Jefferson County and FAMU DRS. Both looking for their first win of the year. And uh, the home team, well, they didn't have something to help the first. Uh, fumbled snap, Jonah Pride, the big fella, rumbling, stumbling, bumbling. See you later. Touchdown, baby rattlers on the scoop and score. 47 yards, 6 0 in a flash. Jeff Co would force a safety, however, to make it 6 2. And then the Tiger offense woke up. Yeah, this another phenomenal play. Travis Keaton, one miss. How about another whoop? And how about another, uh, whoop, come on, three in one play. Gang tackled, can he get in there, Mr. Ref? Yes, sir, he can. Touchdown, Travis Keaton. Touchdown, Jefferson County. 35 yards to the crib, eight to six after a two-point try was no good. How about Keaton again, still in the first quarter. Maybe not as crazy, but still pretty impressive. 45 yards all the way down the sideline. Touchdown, Jefferson County. 14 to six here, and they would not look back. The Tigers in the win column, Lenoris Footman, Gets his first win as head coach, 36 to 12, your final score. Unfortunately, north of the border, not as good. Valwood went on the road to take on Tift area. They had a 20 to 6 lead at half before Tift area stormed all the way back, 41-40, your final score there.